What's up, guys? So, uh, recently, you know, I just got the AR-53, and uh, something piqued my interest. You know, I was wondering, you know, I'm pretty close to AR-55. I wonder how long it'll take me to, like, get there and maybe even get AR-60. So I started doing some personal research, you know. I was like, you know, let me get into research depth. I went to some sites, you know, mostly Genshin, data leaks, and, like, all that. Even some, like, players who got to, like, AR-55. And, uh, yeah, something surprised me. If you see here on the top left, this beautiful, uh, or not beautiful, this is pretty horrific uh, graph right here. This is the amount of XP it costs to rank up in adventure levels past AR-55. So to initially get the AR-55, it'll cost you 36000 you know. That's reasonable. It's like the average right now. It's usually like 21000 26000 from 50 to, what is it? I don't know, 55 but then after that, this is not a typo. I can guarantee you this is the number. 232,350. Yeah. Uh, you're not wrong. That's the number on your screen right there. That's how much it's going to cost you. And then I did some more research to confirm this. And it's true. Th these are the values right here. The values. I'm pretty sure this is all confirmed. I might be a little bit off, but this is really the rough estimate. Not in the rough estimate. This is straight up the numbers. And then that got me thinking. How long would it take people for, to get AR-55 to AR-60? And after I started doing the math, um, it got longer and longer and longer. I did not expect it to be this huge. The number to be this huge. First of all, how can you even get AR level, right? level, right? So, you know, obvious methods, daily commissions. Use your 180 resin daily. And for the big whales out there, max resin refills. And uh, this is just the most consistent way to get AR level, right? Daily commissions, you know, you get your classic 1500 if you're doing them, which you should. You can get 60 primos, you know, best way to get primo gems right there. Then daily resin, obviously you should be using that. And for the free method, you get a minimum of 3,300 resin daily, right? This does not include, like, you know, the main quest, the side quests, and the events that come out. Because usually this, these, uh, the main quest gives you around, like, what, 1,000, 2,000 resin? Or not resin, uh, adventure rack, maybe? I don't remember. Side quests usually give you, like, 100, 200. There's a bunch of them. And the events give you their range, right? Recently, we had one, I think, for some adventure rack level. And, yeah, they just give you stuff right in there. And you got the quest keys. That's That's all I mean, right? That's just like your oddball ways of getting Not the most consistent, but they happen. And then, uh, you know, I started doing some math. And that that's where, it got, that's where it got weird. Weird in the bad way, too. So, from AR-55, it'll, it'll take you 10 days to, like, level up, right? That's pretty average. From 50 to 55, you know, it's usually around a week or two. And uh, maybe even less because, you know, this is just a rough, like, rounded up version. The exact value right here so 11 days and that doesn't include all this right the main quest side quest all that so i'll take you 11 days to get the ar-55 from 54 that's a reasonable request you know pretty good the rewards for ranking up like what uh 200 primo gems i think and a quaint fate and all that yeah okay but then from 55 to 56 70 days what is this what the hell is this mahoyo you, you got people playing for 70 days to get to 56. Is there even a level 56 in the game right now? Like, how is it even possible? Have you been max refilling from day one? That's probably the only way. There's no way. Is there... I don't think there's any person in the game that's 58, 59, 60. There's actually no way. Unless you... Maybe there is. You have to be refilling every day. And that's going to cost a lot of money. Because, like, what is it? 600 people on gems? For daily refills or something. I don't know. I haven't done it. But doing that every single day. Okay. that You better be a very wealthy person to do that. And then you know. 50, 57, 58. Okay. Th these two itself. This is what. I mean. I can't get over the fact. It will take you one third of the year. To rank up two adventure rank levels. This is not normal. Like any game you play. What type of game is getting re getting you ready for over one third of the year with the gameplay? It's not even like, I mean, this is it. even if it's less than that, right? 
you, let's say it's 130. 130 days? What game have you played for 130 days consecutively logged on and you still haven't finished the game? Unless it's like a multiplayer game. But this is a PvE game, right? This is insane. And then it gets worse and worse and worse. 58, 86 days. 59, 94 days. And then to get to 59 to 60, 100 days. You will spend one third, little less than one third of the year just to get there. And this is only for minimum, right? This is for people who aren't max refilling all that. So roughly, I mean, this is the max total, right? Without including all the main quest, side quests, all that. 444 days. And if you want to know how I did the math, right? I basically, you know, it's pretty simple. I divided this number here, uh, 340,125 by 36, uh, or 3330, like 3330. That's what I got that. Pretty simple right there for this and this and this, this. I added this together, divided that, or added it, yeah. Okay, now I'm just losing track. That's it. So for the people who are max refilling, which I don't think there's a lot of them. If you are, you're basically keeping the game alive for every single free to play. God bless for you. And uh, yeah, you'll basically you can already see the great great change here, right? It's not great. You'll just half the time, which is actually pretty good, right? You're spending ha half as less time of like grinding and doing your daily stuff because you are making double, uh, more than double than the average uh, free-to-play player, right? From 3,300 uh, daily to 6,900, which is really big, right? So basically doing two days of resin in one day, which will save you a lot more time, obviously. Um, simple match right there. So five days, 30, 33, 37, 41, 49, 50. Nothing over 50, right? And it gets wider. And wider. It's like 10 days and five days, that might not look too big. Six, 30 to 70, okay, just an extra month. An extra 50 days just to rank up. In total, it'll take you 212 days and 414 days for free to play. I mean, I don't even know what to say, dude. Like, I hope this is some sort of April Fool's joke. And when April Fool comes around this year, Mihal is like, ah, you've been pranked. Yeah, this wasn't supposed to happen. It's a, it's a glitch in the system. I really hope so because... uh. I mean, I like this game a lot. I don't know if I like it that much to play for over a year straight. Uh, I mean, yeah. I don't know what else to say to this. Like, when I was doing the math, I did not expect any of this. At most, I was expecting, like, maybe three or four months just to rank up from 55 to 60. Because the rewards for ranking up are complete trash. Are you kidding me? It's like two fragile resin per? Bro, what is that going to get me? That can get me, like, what, half a day? That's less than half a day. Like, these rewards should be juiced up. Like, they should be giving you, like, 2,000 Primo Gems to rank up per. Plus a coin face, plus books, all that. Because this takes so much time and effort. If you are grinding for this as a free-to-play, I respect you. If you're grinding for it as a whale, too, I'm going to respect you even more because you're keeping the game alive. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what else to say. This is some quick maths. If I've done anything wrong, let me know. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. See ya.